So we can select from the top left corner an example of equivalent fraction. You can also allow the students to see, look at different representations. Okay, and they can see how this is the same or not the same. And uh, let's change it back to circles. And in this example, we can let's say unrelated fractions. And in these unrelated fractions, this is typically difficult for students because of the denominator. So we have to click on the button, say, make same size. And it will subdivide into the common denominator to allow the students to then compare that this has 9 pieces, whereas the other one has 10. And therefore, 10 pieces is larger. And you can click back and it will show back the original fraction. Now this is not uh, the end, we also would like students to then design their own questions. So perhaps uh, I would like to decide for myself, how is three quarters uh, compared to let's say five, uh, let's say five over six. So you got to choose a six first, then choose the five. And then you can see how these are related again.